first we'll create a variable go say go to settings tab variable over you click on add and v number of bars for example variable and v number of bars for example i want to use default value some four click on okay next step is now open this one so, I want to display number of bars in this form. Okay. Next step is I want to assign the variable in input box. First, we need to create an input box. Right click, new sheet object, input box. Select the variable and click on add. Here, just single click here. Label is highlighting. Here, we can give label also. And I give label as some number of bars click on ok third step is we need to assign the variable in bar chart right click properties then go to dimensions tab here we need to assign here in general if you want to give largest 10 values you can give 10 5 values means we need to give 5 instead of giving 5 10 here we need to assign that variable Simply we can type here, otherwise just click here, go to variable, select the variable, paste, OK, apply. See, you will display only 4 bars. Why? Because we have given only 4. See, 4 in, uh, by default value we have given 4. See, and here for example, here I will give 5 will display 5 bars. 2 means 2 bars. 3 means 3 bars. You can display number of bars by using input box. In input box, if I give year, it should display this year list box. And in input box, if I give month, it should display month list box and it will be hidden. Like that. See? In input box, if I type year, it should display year list box. If I type month, year will be hidden and month will be shown. If I type EO, year will be shown, month will be hidden, like this. Go to settings tab, variable over you, then click on add. I will give variable from B display. I want to give default value EO. Second step is we need to assign that variable in input box. Right click, new sheet object, input box, assign this variable. Just single click here, here we can give label. And to give label as year of month. Okay, I give default value here. Now we need to assign the variable in these two list boxes. Properties, go to layout tab, under show conditional, I want to give variable name v display equal to within single quotes EO. And at the same time, here I want to give show conditional v display equal to within single course month oh. see month is hidden here is display for example if I type month here month and click on enter month is showing and here is here we need to take care of spelling for example, if I give year all in smalls, both are not displaying. So, first letter caps, all other smalls. So this is displaying year. And if you give month means, it will display month. Like that. 